Hi everyone, we're going to determine the limit of our sequence a sub n. The first thing we want to do is take this and multiply it by um, the conjugate. So we're going to go ahead and set up our limit as n approaches infinity and write it as the square root of n squared plus 3n uh, minus n. And then we're going to uh, go ahead and put this as uh, 1 in the denominator. Now the conjugate is just going to be this piece as a uh, difference of squares formula. So you're going to just copy it down but put a plus. So that's going to be n squared plus 3n and then you're going to write plus n here. Divide it by and you have to copy it down again. n squared plus 3n plus n. All right. So this part is like your A, this is your B, so we're just going to square our A and get the limit as N approaches infinity of N squared plus 3N and then we have this minus and then uh, you square your B. So it's going to be minus N squared and then in the denominator we're going to have N squared plus 3N plus n. Okay, let's simplify this. Um, the n squares are going to cancel. Now what I'm going to do is um, divide each piece by uh, n. So basically what I'm doing is multiplying the denominator by 1 divided by n and multiply the deno uh, denominator by 1 divided by n. That helps us find the limit. So this can be the limit as n approaches infinity and when you multiply 3n by 1 over n, you're going to get 3. Divide it by square root of n squared plus 3. Divide it by n plus 1. So just divide this by n and that by n. Now what I want to do is rename this uh, n as n squared and put it under the radical. So I can write that as n squared plus 3 divided by n squared. Whoops, put square root again, n squared. So I'm going to do that uh, because that is the same as n. So let's do that and we're going to get um, the limit as n approaches infinity of 3 divided by square root of n squared plus uh, 3n divided by n squared. Now. Uh, since we're dividing by n squared, I'm going to put it under each piece here. And we still had this plus 1. All right. So this is going to give me the limit as n approaches infinity of 3 divided by square root of 1 plus 3 divided by n. And then we have this plus 1. All right. Now, um, this uh, part right here is going to uh, go to 0 as n approaches infinity. So what we're going to get is 3 divided by square root of 1 plus 1, which equals 3 halves. And this is your limit. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. <laughs>